Hi, and welcome to another video. I think I need to change my look. See you in a second. So I have just cut my hair and beard and I think it's similar to my picture that I have taken one or one and a half year earlier. Anyways, let's get into business. So when I came here, it was so exciting to me because new place, new environment and so on as you have already seen in my previous videos I was talking about all the excitement and so on then after two or three days I felt like so lonely in Kopio I was surrounded by friends and that's why I didn't feel so alone because they were always with me and we used to visiting so many places and so on but after I came here I had caught massive amount of time that I didn't know how to utilize that. Then the days went by, I went into deep, deep depression. And why I always talk about the depression? Because Finland is the kind of a country that if you don't have friends or family, then you would feel like the same the way I feel. And that is the most difficult thing for anyone who lives alone in Finland or wherever in the world because human being is created the way they are like they have like good community and have people surrounding by them have friends or families and so on and I was missing that when I came here in the beginning in 2016 and now is the 2020 and I shifted to the capital city and I feel the same when I felt in the beginning but I don't want to say always the disappointing stuff So after three to five days, I started to push myself to do something. And what I did, I started to give myself more activities. And how I did, I didn't maybe share with you guys, like since uh, in the last two months, my life got changed in a remarkable way. Now here, I'm going to tell you the story. About two months earlier, I started to think uh, the way I was leading my life is not the right way I need to change myself and before that I used to sleep in the late night around 1 or 2 a.m. and wake up in the morning around 9 to 10 a.m. and it was so unhealthy I started to get frustrated I, I felt like I didn't have enough time to do any anything like whatever I like or whatever activity and all as well as there were like no productivity in my work because I felt always low and always like shortage of time and so on then I decided how about change my daily life and that decision was a big turning in my life here is how it came I started to wake up early, six, 5 to 6 a.m. in the morning and take a cup of coffee. After that, I take walk outside or maybe some jogging. When I come back, then I take my breakfast and do my regular activities. And one of the activity is like video editing. And this was, as I, as I said in my first video, this thing is going to change my life in some really good way because all the life I didn't have any hobby and recently I got this new hobby and this hobby is like making videos and making it how to make it more nicer way so that I have to learn video editing and I'm doing it and I'm still a learner I don't know when I'm going to be like expert on it but as I know if anyone want to expert on video editing or even any any activities like creative activities then some statistics said like if anyone want to expert in any activities 
from sports to any creative work to any skill if anyone want to have then they have to spend 10,000 hours then they can say like they are expert on it that is how I changed my daily life and when I moved to Helsinki then it was kind of really difficult for me to maintain that routine so after three to five days I started to got back myself to the previous routine and then I saw myself the changes like I again started to feel like so busy but life is like that when you feel like you are going out of your track then you need to pull yourself onto the track then you'll see like just don't get so panicking or anything else and one thing more life is not bed of roses everyone has their own problems I'm here to share my life my experiences and my struggles and my success I couldn't say in my point of view success is something that no one can say like he or she gets succeed or something like that it is something that goes along with your life for example you might see some machines in in ICU or CCU if maybe in your relatives or friends or maybe you saw, saw in TV serials or maybe in some shows or some movies some serious patient is lying down on the bed and uh, there is some machines just making some noise like beep 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 something like that and you can see there some kind of a graph is just going like ups and downs and ups and downs and if it's getting flat line that means that person or that patient get dead and here is my answer came I was always asking myself when I'm going to get settled down or when I get success in my life when I try to connect that thing with real life then I saw something really tremendous and to us like your life is some kind of like going like a graph you might sometimes in the uphill then sometimes in the downhill then sometimes in the up then sometimes in the down and that is really push one person ahead in his whole life and if is getting like straight line then this person is living and dying is the same thing at least it's same thing for me this is how I think my life so whenever I go fall down I always say to myself don't worry Samit, you will you will go up again. This is not the time that you are supposed to in the up. When the time will come and when you give yourself good effort, then you will come back, you will overcome your situation. So just just leave it the way it is and try to focus on your life. By the way, I have some important announcement again and I will not share with you in this time. I'll share with you in the next video probably. This is something make me more excited than anything else and I hope I will able to show you or share you that excitement in my next video. Till then I think I will stop talking here now and I think I, I talk too much. I talk too, too many stuff and I don't want to make you guys bored or something. I try to make the videos more nicer that you guys don't waste too many time on my videos and see something nicer and more engaging. Till then, see you in the next video. Bye bye.